Sometimes when working with clay, we find it necessary to make separate parts and then attach them using the score and slip method. One example is when we're making a mug. If you would like that handle on your mug to have a really good attachment, it's important to score thoroughly. After eight years of teaching ceramics, I've noticed that a lot of people have bad scoring technique. The lines are spaced out, they're also shallow, and it kind of looks like a little checkerboard. Good scoring would actually involve having your lines so close together that you're closing all the empty space, and also the lines are so deep that it kind of messes up your clay. And I like to tell students that it looks like a little beaver chewed up the clay. So if your clay is looking like a little checkerboard when you score it, maybe try messing it up a little bit more like a beaver chewed it up. 